Hi, this is Manan Shalvi. In this episode, I'll show you a workflow to create this text animation that showcases how to work with the new Curve Path Editor in LumaFusion 5.0. As you can see, the text follows a curved path. Let's get started with this title that has a small circle and a vertical arrow pointing up, centered exactly in the middle of the screen. Edit and enable the 5x5 overlay. Make sure that the position, size and rotation are unlinked. Next, show the path editor. Now create this animation using the overlay as a reference. Notice that there is one second between each keyframe and then it slides for two seconds. Next, let's convert those lines into Vizier curves, again using the overlay as a reference. Now, let's add some rotation to make the animation oscillate. This is how it looks after adding the oscillation. Originally, I thought about a 45 degree oscillation. But 90 degrees just looks more fun. Now, let's add some easing so the end of the sliding doesn't stop abruptly. Now, let's form and animate the word paths. Start by replacing the circle and arrow in the title with the letter P in a bold font. If we go to the beginning of the clip, we can see that the letter peaks a little bit. So let's shift position X in the keyframes to the right so we don't see the letter picking at the beginning of the animation. Back in the timeline, make four additional copies of the animation for the remaining letters of the word paths. Change the letter in each of the titles. Place the first title with the letter P 
over a background. Place the second title with the letter A above the first title but shifted by 12 frames. In the second title, correct the end of the sliding so the letter A stops before overlapping with the letter P. Now, repeat the process for the rest of the titles. And we're done. This is how it looks now. So this is it for this episode. If you like this video, please consider subscribing to this channel, give it a like, and click on the bell so you're notified when I post the videos. Thank you for watching, stay safe, and I'll see you on the next one.